Hi! So today I'm going to show you kind of a mini a gift guide. It's not exactly pertaining to the holidays because it is kind of a more general, almost romantic, sentimental gift kind of guide idea. And I'm sorry I didn't have it up sooner because I know the holidays are really close, but one of the things I'm going to show you is handmade. So uh, if you want, you can go to your local craft store and still have time to make it before Christmas. And the other gift ideas that you have to purchase, I'm not sure if they'd be able to ship before Christmas, but if not, you can save it for Valentine's Day, holidays, anniversaries, because they're very sentimental ideas. So uh, first, I'm going to show you something that uh, my fiancé gave me. Um, it was a couple of years ago already. I was in high school, I believe. I think I was a senior, actually. And uh, it's this. And it's from the website kindnotes.com. I'll link everything in the description box. But basically what it is, is you buy a jar or some, sometimes they even have like treasure boxes where it comes with a bunch of tiny notes inside and you get to pick what kind of jar, the ribbon, what is on it, because like this one has a little accessory, and whatever kind of confetti or glitter or extra things that come inside of it. So it's completely customizable. You even get to pick um, what's uh, the kind of envelopes and you also get to pick what goes in the envelopes. So it's kind of like a bunch of tiny love notes. And what my fiance did is he got this for me. Again, my senior year, I, th I think it was for Christmas, I'm not sure, but it came with 31 envelopes. Some of them had love quotes and some of them had things that, that he wrote for me. And I was supposed to open one envelope every morning for 31 days. So it was kind of like a month of a bunch of tiny love notes and gifts. So I thought that was a great idea and I wanted to show it to you guys. Let me open it. And it comes in a beautiful box that you don't even have to really wrap because it's just so pretty. But anyway, this is what the tiny envelopes look like. It'll obviously be closed, but see the detail? And you can get them in like solid colors or patterns. And inside is a tiny note. And I just love things that are tiny. Isn't this adorable? Oh, well, let me read it to you. You mean everything to me. That's what that one says. So obviously he's the one who wrote that. Um, some of the other ones contain quotes. And you can either customize some of the notes, all of the notes, or you can just get pre-rendered notes. So uh, if you're not really sure exactly what to say or how to express what you're feeling, you can just uh, buy either like a love package, a friend package, a mom package. They have all of these customized for different kinds of people. They even have some for teachers. But anyway, so that's what this look like looks like. I thought it was such a beautiful idea and I really looked forward to reading the notes every morning. It was really beautiful and thought out. So I thought I would show this to you guys because I haven't seen that many like romantic gift guides. And again, this doesn't even have to be romantic. You can get this for your mom for Mother's Day, Father's Day. Um, this would be really great for anniversaries for like Valentine's Day. And I loved this present so much that for Valentine's Day, I made one myself for my fiancé. Uh, though back then he was just my boyfriend. But this is the one that I made, and then this is the one that uh, he bought. So you can kind of get them, and depending on how much work you put into it, you can really get something very cool and personal. So I made this with all stuff that I got at Michael's. I got uh, this tin at Michael's. I filled it with a bunch of glitter and see little pink hearts and crystals and they're all wrapped around wire and I even put some real hearts in there uh, that were taken out from a guide and here I, I hot glued ribbon around it that says Chris and Becca and it has like a little heart and I got the personalized ribbon at personalizationmall.com you can order ribbon with your name on it, your anniversary, all kinds of things, special dates so that would be really great for like if you're um, hosting a baby shower or a wedding and you want to have a personalized bow or things like that, that would be great but anyway, so I filled this up with a bunch of tiny envelopes and I don't have them with me because when Chris opened them he put them into a different box and it's high up and I can't reach it but um so on the inside it's full of glitter. But anyway, I just wanted to show you guys this for as an option. You can either make this very simple or very elaborate. The little tiny uh, notes that I got were 
the same size as these envelopes and they were from Martha Stewart. So Martha Stewart sells very small envelopes that you can get to put inside here or you could just fold up pieces of paper and hand write all of your notes or you could print them out. It's very customizable and it's a very thoughtful answer. You could even write 365 of them so he or she will have wonderful like mini love notes to open every day for an entire year and it could be as simple as you have beautiful eyes or I love you or you mean the world to me you know things like that or it could be inspirational quotes it the opportunities are endless and I just think it's a very great uh, it's just a very great and thoughtful gift so I wanted to show that to you guys so uh, Chris bought me this one and I made this one so that is the first thing I wanted to talk to you guys about. And then the second and third things are just kind of like tips and websites that I think that you guys should look into if you want a very uh, thought out, personalized, unique gift. And I don't have physical things to show you because the stuff I have is at my mom's house, but I wanted to film this and put this up as soon as I could for you guys. Um, but uh, the two websites that I want you guys to look at are, um, well obviously other than kindnotes.com, is a personalizationmall.com and thingsremembered.com and those two websites have really great and unique like romantic sentimental thoughtful gifts and they're all very unique because they're all they can all be customized and by customized I mean like engraved or um, you can add a photo to them you know things like that and uh, I think my favorite out of all of those would be thingsremembered.com and they have a couple of uh, uh, stores also. I think Personalization Mall is just online, but Things Remembered you can get at stores. If you want to get something from them, I would definitely go to find the store locator on their website because if you go to them, you can get it personalized and pick it up the next day. But anyway, Things Remembered and PersonalizationMall.com have things like uh, jewelry boxes and you can get picture frames that are customizable like uh, for Chris's grandparents 50th wedding anniversary because they've been together for over 50 years and that's just amazing. Uh, we got them a picture frame that was entirely customized like it said the date of their wedding like when they met their names and it had two pictures that you could put in it so you put a picture um, so there's a picture of them when they first got married and then a picture of them on their anniversary. So I thought that, that was really nice and you can pick like the color of the frame and things like that. So that's from Things Remembered. And then also on the personalization mall, I bought Chris a couple of presents for his birthday. Um, I got him, uh, for his 21st birthday, I got a shot glass that had his name engraved in it. And um, also there's a couple of other really cool things like there's uh, pocket watches that you can put something on the inside so I just always think that that's a really cool and unique gift because you don't see very many pocket watches but also uh, you get to personalize it even more by putting someone's name in it or a quote or saying you have all the time in the world or late you're late for a very important date or you know something silly like that so you can engrave those and I just think that like engravings anything that's personalized those kind of things make something very unique and they make great gifts because then there's nothing like it in the entire world. Remember, it's a little more expensive and Personalization Mall isn't that expensive. You can actually get their like his and her uh, towels and they have a lot of actually a lot of wedding gifts. Those are really great too. But um, I'll definitely check out the website if you can. And uh, one other thing that I thought I would mention that I do with my fiance. What I do is like I write him uh, secret messages. So like I have one here, this one I wrote him several years ago. Like here it just says, read me. But after a while and on the front I would write secret message because it was just funny and I would hide it in different places. Like I would hide it in his backpack, underneath his computer, next to his toiletries, uh, under his pillow, you know, different places all around the house and around his items. So then like one day unexpected, he'll find it. And like I've even left secret message for him in his telephone. Like since he has an iPhone, um, I'll leave notes in his notes section and I'll like put the date because since he doesn't use his notes that often, it's just funny that like months later he'll find it and it's, it's cute. So this one says, I love you with all my heart and have a great day at work. And I literally put this in his work pants. So I just thought that that would be a cute thing to mention, just hiding secret notes for each other. It's kind of like a really fun game and when he finds them it's kind of like just a little remembrance that you are loved and somebody is thinking of you. So uh, that's 
my kind of gift guide, not really, because I didn't mention that many items, but I thought I would just share it with you because um, I know a lot of people have a hard time figuring out what to get their boyfriends, fiancés, husbands, uh, just their friends or family, and these I thought were some great gift ideas. So I'm sorry it's so short. Uh, if you have any questions or anything, make sure to leave them down below. And if you have any other romantic suggestions, make sure to leave them in the comments below because I'm sure everybody will benefit from them. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful holidays and I will see you soon. Bye.